dear witches, pagans, and responsible people out there, magical folks, um, it is time to get off our butts and not only do some serious magic for this planet, for the people of this world, for our fellow humans, animals, creatures, plants. Um, so I urge you all to get out there and do something, actively do something. If you are unable to actively participate in helping our planet, helping our fellow humans, helping our fellow creatures, then donate to someone who can. Um, spread the word, write a strongly worded letter if that's all you can do. Uh, send emails, tell your friends. Uh, we are in a critical point in our planet right now and there has been a disturbing um, trend even in the witchy pagan community of go to your altars, do some spell work. That is wonderful, but uh, it can take the same criticism that the uh, Christian right gets for sending thoughts and prayers, right? Um, I think thoughts and prayers are beautiful and should not be discounted. However, take the next level, take the next step, do more. Um, donate your time, your money, um, sacrifice your morning latte, sacrifice your next deck of tarot cards, sacrifice your next witchy book purchase, and put that money towards someone or some organization that you can find that you trust who will help get things done. We are in a point of crisis on this planet. And as a human race, as caretakers of uh, the plants and animals that we coexist with, uh, we are failing. And those of us that are working towards being more enlightened and being more um, at one with everything and every, the universe, this is part of it. Um, we cannot sit still. We cannot just sit back and watch. Um, there is no time left if, if we don't act immediately. And yesterday, it needed to happen yesterday. We are um, not taking enough of this seriously. Um, even if you believe this is all a holographic universe or whatever, there's st still evidence that we are living, breathing things. And this planet lives and breathes with us. Every creature, every tree, every flower, animal, body of water is important. And we cannot just sit back and let the arrogant, greedy, and ignorant people that have managed to take control of politics and government, um, we, we cannot let them win. Uh, this is a fight that everyone will lose uh, if this continues. I'm going to put a few links down to some organizations that I trust um, and that are help, going to be helping with the Amazon fires, um, children at the borders, um, water rights, all of these things, EPA concerns, uh, environmental action agencies that will actually make change happen um, if we give them their, our support. Um, I will do my research. I urge you to do your research. I urge you to absolutely go to your altars, uh, go to your spells, do your casting, um, 
whatever uh, will get that motivation going for you to then act and maybe that spell work and that altar work will push it to the next level and will give you the strength and motivation to continue um, working towards something besides just, you know, getting what you want. We are a collective. Uh, we need to look out for each other and put aside your politics and think about the fact that we need a place to live for the rest of our lives and our children's lives and their children's lives. And I know we are in a very turbulent time of change and unrest. Um, and those of us who are empathic feel it even heavier than others, I think, but we're all in this together. But I urge you to make a small sacrifice today, this week, this month, for as much as you can. Don't ever think that what one little thing you can do doesn't count because it does. Because if we all do one little thing, it becomes one big thing. If we all donate one tiny amount of money, it becomes a lot of money. Um, I do not have a lot of money. I am working towards changing my financial situation, but I have debt I need to pay, but I am still going to give what I can to help because I can't be in the rainforest. Um, I have physical limitations that keep me from being an activist out in the, you know, actively doing things. Um, however, there are people out there that can and they need our, and they need assistance. So support who you can donate where you can it goes beyond altar work and prayers that is important intention is important sending out love is important but it is just the tiniest step to what we need to do so i implore all of you out there if you re if you see this consider a sacrifice those of us that are privileged enough to be in homes with running water that is clean, that can put food on our tables and that we have a choice of what food that is. Um, consider cutting out red meat. That's a major part of what's going on with the rainforest is um, they're trying to make room for cattle farming. So there are choices we can make, um, simple choices not even giving up red meat, but if you reduce it or be sure you're only purchasing from a local farm or a local butcher, um, things like that can make a big difference. Pay attention to your purchases. Your dollars count. They really do. Um, you may not think they do. I mean, economics being what it is, um, if enough of us make these choices and they are not easy choices, these are sacrifices. I'm going to do a whole nother post on sacrifice, a whole nother video soon as it's a, it, it's been weighing on me about the lack of sacrifice that I make. Um, and our cultures sort of not, not one to make sacrifices. We're a very, very me, me, me culture for the most part. And um, sacrifice is something that I have come to realize might be necessary to get magic done well and to get progress made. Um, these are just things I, I urge you all to please consider as you go about your day. If there is something that is a luxury or a privilege, I want you to consider taking that energy or money that you would use towards that thing and putting it out into a bigger space, putting it out into the world uh, where it can make change, where we can save what's left of our dying culture, planet, environment, all of these things. Uh, that's my plea to you. Um, and I will hopefully talk more later, but please absolutely go to your altars today. 
do some spell work to save what we can um, to help who we can and then take another step. Thank you all so much. Blessings and good day.